Paris Jackson and Janet Jackson don't exactly have a picture-perfect aunt-niece relationship. What was the deal with that infamous on-camera altercation? And are they back on good terms? Keep watching to find out. Despite their ups and downs, it seems like Janet is still looking out for Paris after the tragic passing of Michael Jackson, regardless of whether or not it's advice her niece wants to hear. Janet issued a warning to Paris during a December 2011 ABC News interview after Paris made it clear she wanted to work in the entertainment industry, something that may potentially have been a source of contention, though. The fact that Janet urged her not to do it after being asked what she thought of the youngster's career. I told her, I said, you, you should really take this time to enjoy your youth to its fullest, because you lose so much of your childhood right. in this industry. Still, she expressed her support with some hesitancy. <sighs> I'm happy for her because this is what she wants to do. At the time, Paris was 13 years old and had just landed her first movie role, so it's very possible being told by her aunt not to pursue her acting career may not have gone down so well. Paris has continued to act since, despite Janet's warning. Okay, here's the biggie. That infamous altercation involving Janet and Paris at Paris's grandmother and Janet's mom Katherine Jackson's compound in 2012. This one hit the headlines big time after CCTV footage leaked online showing something going down between the family members. The video featured someone alleged to be Janet appearing to try to take the cell phone belonging to someone who looked like Paris in the driveway. Police were called, though nobody was arrested, with TMZ claiming and later retracting that Janet and her brothers, Randy and Jermaine Jackson, turned up at the compound uninvited and tried to force Paris and her brothers, Blanket Jackson and Prince Jackson, into a vehicle. TMZ also initially reported Janet called Paris a quote, spoiled little b and claimed a scuffle ensued, with Catherine's nephew Trent supposedly trying to break up an altercation involving Randy and Jermaine. However, TMZ later took back the story, instead making it clear Janet did not slap or otherwise touch Paris, nor did she verbally abuse her. According to Radar Online, Catherine's attorneys spoke about the incident in a statement, saying, Certain Jackson family members ambushed Catherine Jackson's home. After exiting their vehicles, Jackson family members ran up to Michael's children as they yelled and began to to aggressively grab at the cell phones in their hands. She claimed the trio was taken to a safe location before police arrived. Weddings are supposed to bring people together, but it doesn't look like that was the case when Janet wed her now ex-husband, Wissam Almana, in 2012. Paris was allegedly threatening to boycott the wedding, according to a report from Star Magazine, and supposedly hadn't spoken to Janet in more than six months after a falling out. A source added they supposedly hadn't reconciled after past drama, which may or may not have involved that infamous CCTV leak. However, Janet later claimed they didn't have many guests when they walked down the aisle anyway. In fact, they kept things so small most people didn't even know they were officially married until several months later, according to E! News. In a statement posted to her website in February 2013, which appears to have been deleted in the wake of their split, Janet described their ceremony as quiet, private, and beautiful, though it's not been confirmed if Paris or any other family members for that matter attended. Janet also shot down reports claiming they planned an extravagant wedding, after the National Enquirer claimed they were inviting 500 guests. The false report also stated they were spending $20 million on the ceremony, including handing out $10,000 Rolex watches as wedding favors. But if the couple really did invite 500 people, would Paris have made the guest list? They say absence makes the heart grow fonder, but that's probably not the case with this one. Back in May 2018, Paris caused quite the stir when she was noticeably absent from the Billboard Music Awards, during which her aunt, Janet, received the Icon Award. Making her absence even more suspicious, several of her family members did attend, including her grandma, her aunt, and even her brother, Prince. Writing on Instagram stories, Paris claimed she had absolutely no idea Janet was being honored and hadn't declined the opportunity to attend because she was never even even asked. She wrote, No one from my management reached out to me about attending billboards or about the award, and no one from my family did either. I had absolutely no idea until y'all spammed with hatred. According to People Magazine, Paris then scolded those seemingly trying to get involved with her family affairs, adding, Please do not tell me, demand, try to control how I handle my relationship with the people in my life, specifically my family. As amazing and as as things can be. It's no one's business but ours. She also suggested there wasn't any drama with Janet, as she shared a sweet photo of them sticking their tongues out to her Instagram story with the caption, Congrats, Auntie. You earned it. Have you ever discussed maybe collabing with her? 
Um, we haven't talked about it, but like, I'm not opposed to it. I love, you know, collaborating with all kinds of artists. The Jackson family may need a little ice for this burn, since Paris wasn't afraid to put her family, seemingly including her aunt Janet, on blast on social media in April 2018. This one went down after several reports claimed that the Jackson clan were worried that Paris, who has shared her mental health issues publicly, was in a downward spiral. Paris clapped back on social media, suggesting very few, if any, of her extended family members had actually reached out to her personally. She said on her Instagram stories, apparently people think I'm about to die. My therapist texted me about it laughing, though, so that's good. I guess to the family members that are talking to all of these news outlets saying you're worried for me, when was the last time you called me? She then added that her brother Prince wasn't worried about her because they talk regularly, bluntly telling her family. If you're worried about me, call me. The social media clapback appeared to be in response to a story from Page Six a couple of days earlier, which claimed the Jackson clan was concerned over her, quote, bizarre behavior. An unnamed relative spoke out to the outlet and suggested the Jacksons were worried about Paris being taken advantage of, particularly when it came to her relationship with model Cara Delevingne. Another alleged source of contention between Paris and Janet is supposedly the funeral of Joe Jackson, Janet's dad and Paris's granddad. Radar Online alleged in June 2018 that there was bad blood between the two and they argued about the funeral plans because they had such differing opinions on Joe. Though Paris thought the world of her late granddad, it was claimed that Janet had a more strained relationship with the Jackson patriarch, who was a driving force behind turning her into a star. What's your name? Janet. You sing with the group? In the Jackson 5 family, everybody works. The outlet also claimed that the two fell out over money, with an insider claiming. Janet has said she'll pay for it because she believes Paris paying for it would be an embarrassment to the family. Joe died at age 89, with TMZ reporting he passed away in a hospice facility. He was somewhat of a controversial figure, with several outlets speculating about how hard he may have worked his kids to ensure they saw success. Joe managed Janet, her brother Michael, and the Jackson 5. Paris appeared to deny the reports of tension, though, and took to Twitter to slam claims she was on the outs with her famous aunt. In July 2018, she hit back. Janet and I haven't argued in over six years. Stop with these stupid rumors. I have nothing but love for my family, and they all know it. As of March 2022, Paris has nearly 4 million Instagram followers, but her aunt Janet isn't one of them. Despite being a regular Instagram user and following more than 180 accounts, Janet apparently never clicked the follow back button for her brother Michael's daughter, even after Paris shared her Billboard Music Awards congratulations post for her aunt, Janet didn't give her a follow. As for why the love will never do hitmaker doesn't keep up with her niece's regular updates, we're not sure, but it's not like she doesn't follow any of her famous family members. She clicked that follow button for her brother Randy and also follows the hashtag Janet Jackson. The star even interacted with her brother on social media in October 2018 after Randy attended the Global Citizen Festival in support of her. In a caption alongside a video of him watching Janet perform, he wrote, Great job, sis. Janet commented with a hugging emoji and a kissing emoji. It's possible Paris shouldn't take the no follow too personally, though. Paris's brother Prince Jackson also follows Aunt Janet on Instagram, but doesn't have the honor of a follow back. The Atlantic Ocean may actually be another reason Paris and Janet don't seem to have been very close over the years. It's been claimed that the two never managed to build a strong connection because Janet built a life for herself across the pond. Janet's lived in London for several years, and it was claimed in 2018 by an E! News source that Paris doesn't talk to her aunt very much because she's just so far away. The insider suggested that was one of the primary reasons they don't have a super tight bond, noting Paris is much closer to her brothers because they have spent so much time in close quarters. As for Janet, she's shared on multiple occasions how much she loves living in the UK, even sharing restaurant tips on social media. In September 2020, she tweeted her foodie recommendations about a London restaurant that made her quote, feel right at home. The star originally lived in the English capital with her now ex-husband, Wissam Almana, but moved out of the home they lived in together in the wake of their split. Check out one of our newest videos right here, plus even more Nikki Swift videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.